sometimes when we send a message to a friend, we get a bounce back. A bounce back is essentially a message from the server saying that it could not deliver your message for X, Y, or Z reasons. Sometimes it's because the IP reputation that you're sending to has been blacklisted. Sometimes your email that you're sending may have been uh, considered spam or looked like spam or represented something, uh, something like spam and the server blocked you for whatever X, Y, and Z reason. Uh, sometimes it's a bad RDNS. Um, so there are a whole host of reasons why you might receive a bounce back message. In any case, if you should receive a bounce back message at any given time, what we need you to do is to click on the message in Outlook or in any other and forward that to us. That's the first priority. But before you forward anything, what we also need is something called the header file. Now this is not something you can see right away, but if you were to click on the bounce message, supposing this is a bounce message now, and we were to go right over here into the body of the message and right click, we can go click, we can use the view source in Outlook, and uh, this is the header. And here's what it looks like. It's a, just a strange uh, garble of information um, that helps us better solve your issues. It gives us IP addresses and phone numbers and breaks, and it'll have a whole bunch of information. You see, when you just forward us the bounce message, the header file changes because as it goes through the server and sends to us, there's going to be a whole host of new information attached to the header that may interfere with what we're looking for. So what we want you to do is right click on the original bounce message, view the source, copy the original header file first. Let's do that by doing a select all. Then we can do the forward. Copy and paste that anywhere in the document. Put our email in here, help at mmechicago.com. Click send and we'll be happy to get back to you. If you have any questions, feel free as always to call our office line. Uh, our clients know that.